G'day trendsetters, coming to you from the Full Speed Ahead booth, FSA, for the official launch, the North American launch that is, of the FSA Wii semi-wireless electronic shifting drive train the 12 speed variant i have reviewed the 11 speed variant you can check it out linked in the description below we'll get some little scoop on this system in a moment here it is over here on the stand i want it to be right don't mind the pastries and here's another close-up look at the system it's very similar to the former 11 speed variant very similar lever shape no visual changes really i'll get the 411 so to speak but i understand that the old shifters will not pair wirelessly with these derailers so you basically have to go this system only and it's disc brake only no rim brake support for this system so for those not seen up there's your rear derailleur there's your front derailleur and this is semi wireless so for this display unit there's a battery inside so basically these two components are connected by a wire and they can communicate wirelessly with these shifters and here folks is the battery that would reside inside the seat post two connectors so basically one wire connects to the rear derailleur and the other wire connects to the front derailleur now if i didn't mention earlier front derailleur is essentially the brains of the operation so this is not really a system that you can run single chain ringsly. They might be coming later on, but for now, it's mostly a road high performance group set is what FSA is purporting it to be. Here's a quick demo. It shifts pretty fast. Hopefully you can see that in their slides. And these hoods are quite comfortable. I rode these for a while, like I mentioned, the 11 speed version. And here's your front derailleur, so paddles up and down. So, shifts the derailleur right there. And we'll do that one more time for the rear derailleur so you can check it out. And here's the paddles to get the light there. So up and down, pretty much. Pretty simple system to operate. It's still not as fast as the R2. There might be a chance I'll be doing a project like this particular group set in the future, so watch this space.